science and y'all know that's not my strong point but hey y'all and welcome to hot chocolate chat today i'm drinking a water and i want to talk about measurements specifically weight i belong to several like weight loss support type groups on Facebook and in one of the groups this girl writes oh I gained two pounds last week ugh and she said she hadn't really done anything different she was still working out and so one of the girls comments she goes oh it's muscle weight and I'll be honest I really don't know how all the all of that works because that's like science and y'all know that's not my strong point but I just find it hard to believe that she's going to gain two pounds of muscle in like one week. I mean, without trying to like, you know, uh, bulk up or something. Also, they added into the discussion the fact that muscle weighs more than fat. And I'm like, whoa, 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 wait. I know that's science, science. But let me tell you, a pound is a pound in like weight and measurement stuff. A pound is a pound. So you, if you put a pound of muscle on the scale and a pound of fat on the other side of the scale, they weigh the same because it's a pound. Or am I missing some like obscure science rule that says that a pound of muscle weighs more than a pound of fat when they're both a pound? Now muscle is leaner and denser maybe than fat, but still if you have a pound of this and a pound of that, it's a pound. That's what I want to talk about today. I want y'all to clarify if a pound of fat is different than a pound of muscle. So let me know. If you want to stalk me on Snapchat, it's Side of Awesome. And on Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter, it's Side of Awesome 5. But just don't stalk me in real life, though, because that's creepy.